because we are L-I-V-E, live. That's right. We live. Hopefully that sound good. M-O-U-S-E? That's right. And we got to tell you guys, one of our last, I don't know, that was probably four or five episodes. String Cheese and Applesauce commented on our video or on our on our live stream, and he goes, "After 135 episodes, you guys still don't know if you're live." <laughs> I said, "No, that's just me." I'm like, "That's just me." I don't. I, they probably do. I'm like, "I just don't know." You know, it's, it is what it is. But um, so, did, so did you take advantage of any double VIP points this weekend? I did not, but let me let me let me do a little business here first, BOT, before you start. You sound you in your crisp on the phone, so I gotta take advantage of this. Uh all right, guys. Episode 138. Yes, I see the hashtag in there. Iceberg bricks. Uh, he will soon hopefully pop up in the in the ice box here. We'll uh we'll get him in here. He's got the link. He's having, he's having some internet issues, so he should be in here. But I know Mary boy, put that is here. boy in the freeze zone. Well, Watch who you call him, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Put that young man in the freeze zone. Yeah. Freeze, 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 freeze. Mary Barrow, cold water. We got Darth Hall, classic, hey. classic. Spirit Particles, Brick Buffet. We got Connor McGrath. We got the whole crew here. Flash Pants, Hoosier, everybody in the house. Everybody <sighs> came here to see Iceberg, and he, unfortunately he ain't here yet. So, But we're trying to get him in here. M. Aries is here. Uh, we got other going things going on. So, um, yeah, so we're going to be chatting it up. We got – I looked at it today, though. We only got – first of all, we got two guest poos left. So there's only two guest poos left, which is one tonight and then one next Sunday. And then oh, we don't even know who's in the guest poo, damn it. Neither of them. Ha, 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 ha. You did it on purpose, B.R., you bastard. Ah, ah, ah. We are a chi- tied it to minifig collector. If you're out there, you still in the you still get in this man. You got one, and in the, uh, two weeks it could be anybody's games. So if somebody wins back to back weeks, you got We got a three way tie. We leave it up to the randomizers. The randomizers. I guess Pooh's already loaded up. Again, we're gonna do that. We'll try to do that quarter two like we always do. And that's my that's my new dog upstairs going crazy. So let's get the let's get the one minute update on Toys R Us. What's going on? Been a, been a crazy couple days with a new dog, but thanks for asking there, BR. Appreciate that. Go ahead. Update. Do it. T-R-U. B-O-T. While you're on the phone. Go. Uh, they're going out of business. Damn. <laughs> is something is something replacing them? Let me... Uh, not that I've heard of, but I hear rumors that, like... And I've read online that there may be 200 store, higher-performing stores are trying to sell, but I don't know, but... What's weird is the last couple of days, it's been crazier in there than Christmas, and people are paying full price for crap. Damn, maybe it's just a big marketing scheme. You, n- you know up. what? People and what people have been telling my daughter is they're doing the Christmas shopping because they're not going to be able to get this stuff. That's a good point. Did I did I see a did I see a KB Toys rumor? Did I, did I see something about KB Toys too? Did, did you guys see that? No, no. I saw something on Facebook. I don't know if it was. Fake. KB Toys have been out of business for ten years, brother. Yeah, there was. I, I I don't know if it's fake news. There was somebody saying that they might be trying to revamp that. Or it might have been fake news. I don't know, but no, I they went, saw a couple they went belly up in two thousand nine, man. But so it, would, they, would the lack of TRUs mean more sales for Targets and WalMarts? It would mean more sales for Amazon, probably, because people are going to go in there and see what it's like, and then. Buy it online because remember Walmart doesn't price match anymore. That's true. Oh, thanks, scammers. That's very true. Yep. So they they say that they're the lowest price around, which we know isn't true as it is. But also TRU could have done a hell of a lot better job of advertising that they did price match too, but so that would have helped them a little bit. But about the two hundred stores, what did you say that they're trying to save two hundred stores? Well, there's a rumor that someone's interested in buying 200 stores, but I'm not, sh- and I'm also not sure. I don't believe the Pacific stores have been been marked for closing. I haven't heard anything like that because there's like stores in Japan and places like that, but I haven't heard anything about the Pacific Rim or anything like that closing. I've just heard Europe and USA, so I'm not sure if it's a different company that owns them or what. Hmm. But what killed them is when they went back to private and then you know they got those loans for billions of dollars hell they paid 400 million dollars in interest this year alone 
So what's what's going to happen to all those locations? Gonna They're going to be dormant, just like your old Kmart locations and. Yeah, but I'm saying like their their lease can't be all expired at once on all those, when, right? When you go when you go bankrupt, what are you going to do? Yeah, true. Got to kind of avoid all the leases. You're protected. Yeah. You know. Yeah, MacGyver is a Canadian company is trying to keep 200 stores. Save us, eh? Save us. The Bones was late. VSB is here. Bones is late. He lost a cat and a dog. Dang. Lost a cat and dog? Oh, sorry to hear that. Lost a cat or a cat? Uh, well, either way. Sorry to hear you got lost. Glad you found your way back. Bubba's bricks in the house. What's up, Bubba? I mean, I didn't go to Toys R Us that much. Only time I went there early was to see if they had the new sets out early. But that's just because I'm a spoiled person with you know Walmart and Lego stores and stuff near me. But well, you could always count on Toys R Us to have the CMFs too. So. True, they're all yeah, they're always good about that. Walmart and Targets are really poopy for that. But Darth Hall, uh, he used to go over to Canada because he's actually closer to Canada than he is to the ones in the states. So he he'd go over to Canada to TRU every once in a while. Hmm. And they'd have the uh, they'd have the poly bags out early up there, so he always. It was more expensive there, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was. It was. But Darth Hall's liquid. He don't care. He know Darth Hall. He money. You know how Darth Hall is. How he rolls. Oh yeah, that's right. But that sucks. It does suck. Well, the whole thing is, it's, and it's it's not about you know their prices being higher or anything. It was it's about the experience because even as when we were kids, it it was a it was a treat just to go to a toy store only because that was like heaven, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Looking at everything around, and you know, Walmart and Target aren't anything like that. Yeah, that's so true. all these people are taking their kids. I mean, you should see all the people with their kids in there this weekend, and and they're literally talking about it, you know? Yep. Yeah. yeah, they showed. I I was in I was in Rochester this weekend, and um, they did. Sh- I I went to the one at was Toys R Us in Rochester and Henrietta there. And it was, there was no signs, no clearance signs, no nothing, no liquidation, no none of that stuff that's going on. But like BOT said, the lines for the checkouts were like almost wrapped around the store. Jeez. And and what's sad though, is that the three managers in our store between themselves, between them lost 18, 18 days, weeks of vacation. And they're not paying anybody for vacation. They yanked it all. And the funny thing is, is, my store, the people are loyal. Nobody walked out. Not a single employee has walked out, even though they've been treated like crap. The Woodbridge store down the road, they lost half their employees. They were running on four people over the weekend. Wow. And I, I don't think I would have stayed around. You take my vacation and... Yeah, forget you. Know. you. I'm, I'm losing my job. Who cares? Yeah, I need to. I don't need to be working here. I need to be going out and find another job. Exactly. It's not like you're saying, oh, why'd you leave your last job? Oh, because I walked out. No, because the company got sold. Boom. Yeah, and I'm sure a lot of those people had seniority too. A lot of those people probably were there for a long time. What this one lady in the store was there for 25 years. Jeez. Another one was there. Well, yeah, one other one was there because she showed me her name tag, 1993. Wow. One person lost seven weeks. One person lost six weeks. One person lost eight weeks vacation. I mean, it's crazy. I mean, they just take it from you, and they didn't let the people take their vacations. The last couple of months, because they said, you know, because of the way business was, it, they were busy. They needed coverage. They knew what they were going to do. They knew they were going to. screw They were people. busy. They needed coverage. Get out of here. They screwed these people. Yeah. Dang. It's like not even like they carried so many items besides Lego. Like I, I you can walk around and just if you're into like action figures or Nerf race box cars, Nerf. Control cars, Barbie dolls, Barbie dolls. Yeah, it's like you go. It, I think that's what's going to hurt the most because the uh, is the girl toys because even Targets, Walmart's, and Amazon or Targets and Walmart's don't have that big of a t- female toy section. Yeah, well, Mattel and Hasbro sales are going to drop. But here's the here's the other kicker too. You know, Claire's that's inside Toys R Us they claim bankruptcy as well. I, I we don't have any Claire's inside my Toys R Us. Oh. That's that's well, right. Actually, the that and when I went into that one in Rochester, the Claire's stuff was all police taped off. It was yellow taped off. Yep. Well, the Claire's are in a lot of the malls too. It's like, yep. There's one know. in the McLean Mall up by me here. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. They're they're. They, well, haven't they, uh, they filed on the ninth? When did they close their Times Square location in Toys R Us? A while ago, right? Like a year ago. Yeah. 
I think that was. Yeah, I want to say a sign of things to come. Yeah, even the board games well, had a good. Well, board wasn't game that the old FAO Schwartz or no? I think yep. so. FAO Schwartz, yeah, and then Toys R Us carried FAO Schwartz stuff too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Kids bikes, Thomas the Train. I like Darth Hall's board games. Yep, yep, all that good stuff. Video games something, about the video. Something will come along. I mean, I mean everybody them. bitched about them being higher, but you, you know, now that they're gone, there's going to be a lot of sad a falls. No, nah, something, even, something will come along and replace them. I bet. Uh, like what? Who's who's got the capital to to put that kind of inventory in a store? Mattel and Hasbro. In a brick and mortar store. Maybe someone will come along and you know. You, they'll just, you know, they'll try to get their product by asking to you to sell it to them at a low price. What's going to happen is it's going to go bankrupt. <laughs> Japanese or someone's going to buy the name and reopen. Toys are you. And without the, without the debt, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Planes to trains, the video games. The biggest toy store there is. Or if you're living in Compton, it's Weeby Toys, you know? Yep, that's right. I mean, or yeah, Amazon can open their first... Toy store location. I don't know. Well, Amazon's, oh, you know, open up. Your... I don't understand their business model. They're going to brick and mortar. No, are they? I think just in Seattle, they yeah, had that. that uh, yeah, but one, the, one, they're going to brick and mortar without people in it. They're going they're, just to automated staff. They're opening up somewhere around here. Yeah, but it's not going to have people in it. It's going to have like one guy watching the whole store. Well, let's bum rush it, man. <laughs> like they do the convenience stores. Snatch and run. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you might end up with a, a bunch of baby diapers, but hell. Yeah. That's another thing, man. People are going to be missing that. All the diapers that place, all the baby stuff that place sells. Hmm. Hey, what's up, Kelly? Kelly's here. Kellen's here. What's going on, Kelly? Kellen? I don't know. I mean, I don't know if, if this just means Targets and Walmarts and the remaining four K Marts just expand their toy aisles by two rows, or I don't know. That is true, cool kid. That is that is probably the most we've ever had him BOT talk because we got a we actually got a topic that he's very well versed in. So most of the time we're just talking about fantasy football or other just random. Well, well, well you yeah, well, you watch how how much that freaking ugly giraffe lego set goes up you better buy buy them online when you can because they're not in stores anymore either they're gone yeah oh the crazy drafts that are going for like 30 bucks on off sites the not the 9.99 or the 5.99 lego set yep yep the creepy one yep people are buying them things up you can't find them in the stores anymore yep they might be sold out online just for bricks what's up Brick vibe is here just for bricks. Yeah, I think you know what I think it's gonna happen is they're gonna buy them. It's it, it, it's all gonna bottom out again. All that stuff's gonna bottom out again. Those Batman four packs are going for what 30, 40 bucks right now. It, it, it'll be it'll be down again. I mean, I'm gonna what, miss what, those. What about your what about your Bricktober sets in your poly bag that say Toys R Us on them? You think there's any value in that stuff? I don't know. Do you think anybody would buy Bricktober the name to continue that? You, you know what I did see at Lego store this week. You know the little packages they have with the single minifig? It's got a little card in it for birthdays that they give? Nope. No. Nope. At Toys R Us? No idea. Nope. Well, I'll send you guys a picture. But the Lego store, actually, the guy said, I don't know what these are. They came in this week, and we just started stocking them for five four ninety nine. I said, because they're Toys R Us birthday giveaways. Uh. They can't sell them to Toys R Us anymore. Yep. So... We will, we will see. We will see. Who knows? All those, uh, what, uh, Rocket Raccoons and uh, what, are, what other ones were the Toys R Us ones? Rocket Raccoons. What else were they? The Electro? Is it the Electro? Electro. Uh, Incredible Hulk. Yep. Hulk. I'm sure so, was- did, you, did, you, did you guys get any of the Easter Bunnies or the Duplo Pollies this weekend? Uh, I got one. One Easter, I just placed the order earlier today. Yeah, double vippers, that's right. You did double vippers. I did not do any double vippers. B for C, what's going on, brother? How you doing, my friend? B for C. Just listening in. Just listening in. No, I did not get. I didn't. I didn't get any bunny rabbits. No Duplo poly bags. Even though I was in the Lego store in Rochester, walked in, walked around for about three minutes, and trucked right up back out of there. Nothing for this guy. Even a double vippers. No, nope. we really didn't have much on the 
on anything there. I mean, the wall was crazy. The wall was crappy. There was real much, much on the wall. But just kind of crazy. So still saving up money for Philly. So I got, we got to save up. Because it'll be here a month. It'll be here a month from tomorrow. So it'll be here before you know it. Yeah, another. Well, what is it? Uh, who else is going to carry speed champions too? You know, that's true. We talked about that last week. That's that's probably up in the air as well. You know, who's going to carry that? That's that's probably just going to be Lego Store. Maybe they'll uh, farm that one out. Who knows? Maybe Target will get it now. Mm. Yeah, so. it, it, it's really sad. You know, I mean, we know the management was run bad, but man. Just the convenience of just going into a place like that and getting something, you know? Yep. Yep. We talked about I mean, we talked about it last week or when we were texting back and forth. Remember when you used to have to get that tag for the video games? In the video games? Yep. Set? You used to have to pull that little slip of paper and then go and they let you in that little... Just like buying a bike. Shirt. Yep. They yep. still do that for the bikes. Yeah, and then those uh, power wheel things and everything like that. Yeah. Yeah. But it was always walking up there, and they'd stamp it, and then you'd have to go to that little booth, and they run in the shelf and give you your game, and go home and enjoy yeah, it. Yeah, my son, my son went there today and bought the Mickey and Minnie Toys R Us exclusive pop figures. Oh, I forgot about the Toys R Us exclusive pops too. The Funkos, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a lot of a lot of, and there's the Jeffrey the Giraffe pop. You know that that'll probably yeah. be worth something, right? They actually, uh, Funko just had that on Friday. It was Thursday or Friday of last week. It was their on their shop at home type site, Funko Shop at Home. Mm -hmm. It was the it was the flocked Jeffrey the Giraffe. He was sad. Bucks. Yeah, fifteen bucks. It was boom. It was it was gone in like minutes. It was sold out minutes. So I can't imagine what that was going for right now on on the bay. Mm -mm -mm. Slot cars and video. Yep, remember got yep, cartridges, yep, MacGyver that's yep. Mm-hmm. Tags, yep, all those tags. That was that was back in the day, man. Had to flip up things where you could flip it up and see the back of the game and look at the back of it. Gone are the days, man. And the pre order and the pre orders, you could do the pre order stuff. And... Yep. Yep. Hmm. Jeffrey and Friends is sold out online. There you go. Brooklyn Bricks. You heard it first here. Boom. So that's gone too. Your online Jeffrey and, Jeffrey and Friends set. Oh, the creepy one? Yep, yep. Yep. So X21. What's up, X21? How you doing, brother? All the way over from I wouldn't be surprised if CKB didn't buy all those. So. <laughs> uh, we'll see them on the off sites at, at forty and fifty dollars a piece. Yeah, Who's selling it? In the oh, store. You better check see, you better check Cool Kid Brick <laughs> store there. The free builds too. Oh yeah, the free builds. That's a good point. Angry Dragon saw him sneaking in. That's a good another good point. Some of those I bet you would would go for a couple bucks more than obviously free because that's what they were. So, Ukla the Mook or Ukla the Mook, the Mook the Mock. He's in the house. What is going on, my friend? Fifty dollars at Philly Brick Fest for Jeffrey and Friends. That's that is definitely a price that well you will see. I am sure of it. I am hey, sure. when you, when you guys go when you guys go to the Discovery Center opening, you guys better get bags. Go. What do you need? The poly bags. He cut out. Yeah, he's cutting out. Did you go back on your computer. No, I'm on the phone. Oh. When, you, when you go, when you guys go over to this Discovery Zone thing, you get me poly bags. Yeah, whatever you need, man. You're coming up Saturday, right? Mm, not sure. You better. You gotta bring all our stuff up, man. <laughs> I gave you that all list. Stuff. I gave you that list of what I need at fifty percent. Fifty percent cost. You better send that to me again. <laughs> oh jeez. Yeah, well, for sure. <laughs> Yeah, you might want to get on that list again. Uh, <laughs> For, forget putting a text because the way you chatty Kathy's talk, I can't keep track of stuff. I'll send it to you directly. So that's we, it. We, we've, cut, we've cut it back lately, man. I haven't even been, you know, we've cut that back lately. I've been busy at so work. So, what did you do on your snow day there? Just watch a movie there, at BR? What did I do on my snow day on Tuesday? I uh, We watched a movie. 
And then I played a ton of PUBG on Xbox. There you uh, go. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah. I just placed my first shop at home order, I think, all year. Yeah. I've been playing Madden all day. So. Madden on the PS4. Nice. 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 Yeah. I've been in that. I, I'll get you on. I'll get you on the network there, B, uh, BOT. We can go check and go toe to toe. All right. There we go. We so can play far. some Dick Mentions. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I put that away. That that that. Uh, I was in that for like a week and a half, and it's it's been collecting dust ever since. What's your PS4? No, the Dick Mentions. Now, did you buy one of the original PS4s, or did you? Did you buy one of the you know later ones? I I had an original. Yeah, I did actually have an original that that died on me. It conked out on me. So, but I had to buy a new one because because uh, I'd like to find one of the originals that plays the older games. You know, the PS3 stuff and all. Yeah, I I toyed with getting rid of it, but I, every time I try to throw, I was going to throw it away or get rid of it. I just I saved it. I don't. I'm going to try to plug it in one of these days and see if it works. But yeah, no old BFD. Those those creepy Jeffries are gone, man. They're, they're they're probably long, long gone. They're not they're not going to be around anymore. If you find them, I would definitely buy a couple of them or all of them. As a, as a PSA from from H and B here. Hmm. So, but uh, this guy is uh, if if this guy does not show up today, guys, we will have him on next week. I'm hoping so. I oh, he's in, he's in the freeze zone right now. I put him. I put them in the uh, cart here. We had the picture all lined up for our thumbnail for the stream here, and we're gonna have to uh, we're gonna have to put somebody. I don't, I don't even know. It's gonna be an empty cart. It's gonna be an empty cart. So might just be a a two by two block, a green green block. Yeah, Connor, I'll let you know, man. I'll definitely let you know. I'll, I'll message you about those. Yeah, I think there's probably gonna be a couple that are only there or only in the Discovery Center. Uh, little store there hopefully by the time we get there they're not all bought up but we'll we'll see bought up what the hell is that bought up. They done they're purchased yeah they per they <laughs> they swooped them all they they swooped all them they they definitely swooped them yeah oh yan shu what's going on yan shu there we go what's up how you doing so was was that your college fic that beat arizona was that buffalo was it that was buffalo? yeah it was university of buffalo yeah university wow. of buffalo and then saint bonaventure was in there too that's around here too but they got well, university of maryland baltimore city beat freaking uva oh is that who that was yeah that was I saw that come through because they were talking about UB, you know, University of Buffalo being like a Cinderella story, and then that happened, and it's like, oh, we felt we got a new Cinderella. Yep. <laughs> Picked up my Speed Champions and a Batman Polly. Okay, okay, OB, you you got to do that. You do you do you. That's cool. I'm getting you. I'm getting well, you. I will tell you. What, OB, wait till you see our you local store there. starts their liquidation on Thursday, I believe. Well, that's when the liquidation company comes in. They come in Wednesday night, so I'm not sure what it's going to look so. Well, I know that Darth Hall's uh, Toys R Us is on the list, so we'll, on that list that I did see online. So we'll see if I'm going to have to have Darth Hall go on our, on our correspondence recon for H and B and see if uh, see what he can see. But I'm supposed to get all the advertising and signage and stuff that's any Lego related stuff from. Oh, nice! Dang! Like get it, get it! Like take it, take it. Yeah, they're gonna give it to me. So nice. you're an honorary employee there. You are. Oh, did you? Yeah, did you decide on that? Are you gonna be for? Are you still? Yeah, I haven't decided anything on that yet. I mean, you even got time for that with work and everything. Well, it's, I can go in whenever I wanted. You know. Oh. Ah. Okay. Okay. What if you take the job and you go in and there's just a back room full of modules? Like, why these? <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to put these out. You want these? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I will. I will. I will yeah. I will, now, I will. If they offer the displays up, you know I'm going to take them things. I will. Oh, I will yeah. pull my truck around to the back, and we can just load it up. Hell, they had a recall on some huge Power Wheels about a year ago, and they threw like seven of them into the back dumpster. Brand new. Wow. What the displays? No, everything in stock. Oh Jesus. Yeah, because like you can't like shoot those no. things back. They just stuck them in the dumpster out back. What do you mean? The like actual Lego? No, no, the power wheels, the big power oh, wheel, you know, the okay. things the kids drive. Yep. They just all oh, the display ones? 
No, they 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 tossed all their inventory of that certain model. There was like eight or ten of them. Dang. That's crazy. You could have just sold those as is on eBay or something like that, or local pickup on Craigslist, or dang, you know. I, I didn't. I don't know if I told you guys back a while ago. I was surfing around on YouTube. There's a kid that dumpster dives, and he's got like five hundred thousand subscribers, and he dumpster dumpster dives the GameStop. Uh, huh. Trash. He just pulls out the clear plastic bags and goes through them. He's found games and gift cards and all sorts of craziness. He's getting like two hundred thousand views a, a video. Crazy. Just a little offshoot there, but figured figured it played well with the whole dumpster thing. So, so yeah. So Toys R Us. So what's the what did you hear about the BOT? What's the uh, time frame then? Is there did they? Well, according our store was supposed to close May fourteenth or fifteenth, but the liquidation company said they've got so much stuff they'll probably stay open longer. Plus, they're still getting two trucks a week just to clear out the warehouse. Jeez. So they're so like they're actually putting Lego on, still putting Lego on the shelf. You know, they're getting more in and in every damn day, huh? Yeah, but then people are going in and buy. I mean, they keep buying all the battle packs, keep yep. disappearing, and then you know, that's I saw the new. Actually, they weren't even the new ones. No, they were the old, the last wave battle packs were twenty percent off at the one TRU I went to, and the, it was literally gone. Like the entire shelf was just empty. Yeah, my daughter was just giving thirty percent off to rent if she liked the way people acted to her. They just give them thirty percent off their orders. Holy smokes! <laughs> Should have went in there. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Good, uh, good uh, point. There. I forgot that uh, Alan Tran worked at Toys R Us. That's right. I forgot he worked at Toys R Us. Did you guys know that? Yeah, he lost. Uh, he lost some vacation. That's for sure. Yeah, I forgot about that. Connor just mentioned that. I, I remember he did post something on Facebook. I did see him post something on Facebook about that. Yeah, I did see that. Yeah, they, they they turned off price matching and all that. I believe so. Yeah. Oh, he works with babies? Oh, he does yes. work with babies or us. Okay. Okay. I did not know that. Same, no. Yep. Same deal. They're closing too. So. Yep. Yep. Either way, it's, it's it stinks. but. It's... And if you had your baby registry and all that, that, that would suck too. That know? would be bad too, yeah. yeah. Some kind of shower coming up or something? Yeah, that would be. It's like those people that have like bridal gowns in the place. That, that happened down here. That happens bridal gown places are bankrupt. Happens a lot around here. Yeah. Saw a guy dumpster dive into Krispy Kreme the other day. My son said, there's home. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's good. That is good. Flash pants always with the zingers. I like it. Mm -hmm. Forbidden donut. <laughs> <laughs> Jeebus, help me, Jeebus. <laughs> Jeebus. Uh, hey, show, show yeah, your uh, Family Guy stuff, dude. Come on, show it, show it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can show that. Yeah, I guess I can show it. It'll be, it'll be. You guys can see it in person in Philly, but I can show that. Show it to the family first, you know. You guys already know that I got uh, with with this was the last one I finished up with BOT's help. I will show you guys last. But you guys know I already got Stewie and Brian here. Chilling out. And then I put together this lady right here. So that's obviously Lois. So we got Stewie, Brian, and Lois. And then, thanks to my friend BOT, I was able to finish up. And yeah, you guys are gonna say his face looks kind of weird with the color, but we tried tan and tan just did not work out very well. Then I fixed his lazy eye. He actually did have a lazy eye today. So there is. Peter. Peter. So there we go. So we got Peter, we got Lois, Stewie, and Brian. So they'll be on display at Philly uh, Brickfest 2018. So if you want to see them in person, if you want to see the, the chin nuts in person right there. Chin nuts. <laughs> check that out in person at the uh, at the Fig and Breaks Hall in a balling area of Philly Brickfest. So come check these out. Say hi to them and we'll uh 
you can take some pictures. I do have to say though that my uh, those uh, templates were sectioned to art. I always give that dude some credit. He's a yeah, that's where I got the ideas from. So section to art on Instagram, check him out. I think he's overseas. Actually, I think he's in England. I want to say he's in England, but um, yeah. So, oh yeah. Meg got left out again for sure. Bubba and Chris. Hmm, I don't know. I was going to do Chris too, but I'm like, yeah, I got the fair, the first four, the main four. I think I want to do uh, American dad next. I think I want to roll into American dad next, but obviously not until a little bit down the road. So again, we got Lois and a sideways Peter. We got the easels for them. You're not today. doing Bob's Burgers? Come on, man. Uh, okay, we're gonna see. Like I said, those are. And I give you know EJ a lot of credit from uh, Abby Dabbles too because he does he does those massive ones. These ones, even these smaller, these are 48 by 48s, and all oh, Herbert would be a good one too. I could totally do Herbert. Bot, I should do Herbert for you. Yeah, you could do Herbert and Quagmire for me. Yep, I could definitely do that. But the the mosaics. <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, that's our that's actually our special guest. It wasn't iceberg, it's actually Quagmire. <laughs> food bricks? Is that a food brick sighting in the chat? No food bricks. Foo you. Foo you. But uh yeah, but these are 48 by 48, and it's just a these two I I used a lot of my own parts. I had the last last two down here. This is medium blue around the backdrop. So that, that medium blue is not the uh not the most uh, in stock color around. So I think it was, uh, was it ABC Brooks? ABC Builds? Yeah, it was my our buddy. Yeah, he was, his store had the most of that. So shout out to him. I actually put, picked that up from him. So that's Don, Donny Aber? I think so. I think it's ABC. I want to say it is. So hey, I got a question. Why didn't you do it? Why didn't you do a video on the package I sent you? Is the other set in there secret? Is that what this, the problem is? Yeah, it's a, I told you it was, it's a gift. It's a beating. Well, do, you, do you believe he really looks at your videos? I, that would be the one he would look at. I'm, yeah. He's always on. He's always on YouTube. He's always on, on yeah. YouTube. He, he knows Uncle Jim's videos. So I'm just giving you a hard time. I'm, I'm I'm busting your face nuts there, pal. I know. I know. I was excited to see that showed up at the door, though. That was nice. It was a good box too. That was a nice box. Yeah, yeah but that's a, that's a large uh, priority box, man. Just pay the uh, large priority price for it. It's a game box, so. Oh, is that what? The, okay, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Excited to get the Jurassic World truck, Angry Dragon. That's good. Good, good stuff. Food Bricks is parting out fifty copies of Minecraft. There you go. Are you are you stateside, Foo? Are you still in? Hey, whoa, whoa! No self promoting in my chat, buddy. Get out of here! No, I'm like kidding. Where is he? Is, he, is it, Are you still over in Thailand? Dude, it's Minecraft. Real? It's going to sit there. Don't worry. He's parting out from Thailand today. Is that what he's doing? I don't know. Parting out from the land of the... Is it the rising sun? or? That's Japan, oh, Jack. Nope. Whatever. He is stateside. See, so he, <laughs> he, he, he corrected all of us. Thailand is the, it, Thailand is the, the land of alley hookers, dude. Get it right. Yeah, I figured you were going to go to that to that thing. And that's <laughs> yeah. very... Uh, that's very, uh, very stereotypical of you. Very stereotyping there, BOT. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh, so yeah. So I finished those up. So that's I'm, I started the pack up last week, and unfortunately, this weekend again with the new edition, I haven't really been down here at all. So you but, getting that Dino Brickhead, buddy? What Dino Brickhead? The Jurassic World Brickhead. They made a Brickhead of a Dino. No. Uh. You can any brick heads. I told you that. I'm not a brick fan, bro. Oh, are you? Well, then pull it up, man. We got oh, some. We got I some didn't know we were ready, man. Are we ready? Yeah, we got there. We went 34 minutes. We're just talking almost. Oh, we were, we were waiting for Iceberg, man. Dude, dude's got us on the block right now. No, but aside, so we got 21 likes, 22 watchers. Look at this, man. This is right, the most like show of the year. Screen share. Oh, the run here. 138 episode, man. Likes are. Hand in hand with the watches. They're all what here. You want to see? You want to see this? Share. Oh, that's my fantasy yeah. baseball rankings. Hang on, we don't want. We don't want to see that. Nobody want to see that. They barely tune in when we talk about fantasy football. You don't want to see fantasy baseball. Bump, bump, bump. Right, we don't care about the winner because we're none of us. No, none of us. Okay, we didn't win. Jesus won. Jesus P. <laughs> it was. 
Jesus P. Yeah, Jesus one, see? Jesus one? Right. Oh, yeah. Jesus talking about this, I don't know what the hell this is. Top global company, whatever. I don't care. Here's the, what I was talking about. Oh, there it is. Still won't want it. Still don't need it. Reported to be 20 bucks. Okay, no. Is it? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 20 bucks, yeah. I don't even... He, Chris Pratt don't look too bad there, but I don't... I don't yeah, no. I just... That's... I don't know. Dinosaur. Designer video, man. Do anything for me. Build your own wooden duck. That's pretty cool. Oh, D. I for, yeah, D. Oh, I am getting my... I'm getting my... Uh, Sig fig brickhead. That's cool. said. That's that's a gift, and that that will be very well appreciated and accepted. So. Yeah, some sand green up there. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Look at that. Oh, is that printed? Oh, is that a print? Oh, that looks like a. Is that a sticker? That looks like a sticker. What are we thinking? I think those are printed. Those are printed. Okay, looks kind of a stickerish, but or sticker s, but I guess not. All right, keep rolling. What else you got? Hang on, man. Send a message out. Oh, he's messaging. Yeah, I picked my fancy baseball keeper, so it's, I, I came in first last year in my league. Hey, you won a what? 15 hundo? Yeah. Nice. That's good stuff. Brickheads are printed. Okay, cool. Thanks, Angry Dragon. All right. Play, play. <clears throat> there are All two right. more stickers. All right, cool. I appreciate uh, it. I don't care about that. Build your own duck. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, I saw that. That is pretty cool, actually. Infinity War final trailer release coming out April 27th. So I'll know what's going on. Seasonal promotional bunny. Got one of these coming on the way. Yeah, I didn't get one of those. I was I was debating rather. I was 60th one of those. anniversary collectible oh, booklet review. We didn't. Yeah, we didn't talk about this. Some people have been getting their books. And as I, I was wrong, I'll have to tell cheap ass. I don't know if he's watching, but. They are individually numbered. I did Alan, not. Alan Tran got 482 out of 15,000. Yep, which is a very low number, like he said, but I did not really. It actually does look like a pretty cool book, honestly. It, I it was does. expecting it to be that. This, cool. this right here, this top 10 sets of all time. Can you, you, can we you get a pick? You know, there's going to be. Uh, there it is, going to flicker. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, I got some of those. I got, got some of those. You got Town Plan, Imperial Star Destroyer, which is right over there looking at me, not built. Giant Truck. I don't know how that got on there. Airport Shuttle. That's good. Yeah. Castle. That's good. Black Seas Barracuda. That's good. Galaxy Explorer. Good. Santa Fe Super Chief. That's good. Green Grocer and then Cafe Corner. So, you know, these. these, these I, I, I'm, I'm thinking these are going to be the next 10 remakes right here. Like, like if they're going to remake any of these sets, why not make one of the top 10 Lego sets of all time a remake? You know, if, if if I had to guess on any of them on there, honestly, I would probably say the last two are going to be it. Green Grocer Cafe Corner. Yep. No, I'm, I'm not, my money's on Giant Truck because they're going to do Giant Truck probably. You think? I don't think Town Plan will be remade. I don't think the Black no. Sea Barracuda will be remade. As much as I would love to see the Santa Fe Super Chief come back with some more cars, I don't think that's coming back. Um, these two. Good chance. Pipe dream for the airport shuttle. Star Destroyer, I can see that being remade. That definitely. Castle, yellow castle. Eh, I mean that's that's so old. I don't I don't I don't see that coming back. Yeah. That would piss you off, wouldn't it? Yeah, I'd be upset. That in the space. I told you if the space ever came back, that might be when the, that might be the day I, I'm done, man. That would be dark ages for ficking bricks here. All the classic stuff got re released. That'd be that would be not good. So what's the uh, so what's that on the other side? Eighties, seventies? What? Uh, is that, is that I don't there, know. Do I uh, arcade. I don't, I don't know what those are. Oh, is that the user one hundred and one seven five to build a model? Oh, so you got to build. So you got to build. So this, they have. So. Yeah. I think there's. I think it's actually in the. Those are some of the instructions that are actually in the book. Oh yeah, here they are. There, yep. There you go. Nice arcade console there. Uh, All right, Tron Legacy. You know, I I was given cheap ass some some meds on this. I really care for this, but the uh, 
I saw a close up of the figs, and those those are some pretty good printed figs. I'll give it that. Yeah, yeah the figs look sweet. Yeah, I definitely like the figs. I gotta I gotta watch Tron while building this one day. Yes, the figs are uh, cool. Dude, these showed up. These pilot bags at a Walmart. There you go. There you go. Kind of looks Toys like my picture. Be closing all U.S. stores. Looks like it's only thirty thousand people losing their jobs, including Alan. Damn. Thirty-three thousand, actually. Yeah, that's what he said. Thirty thousand. Toys R Us Canada will not be affected, but Toys R Us UK will be closing their stores as well. Oh, we got to get food, food. So Toys R Us Canada is not closing. Interesting. Oh, Bones, we got guest poo. We got five minutes for guest poo. Don't worry. It's going to be yeah. there. Yeah. I'm curious about Asia. Nobody talks about Asia. Hmm. Uh, that X, X21, that was the, uh, the new Dude, Milano. That's another part time gig lined up already. That was a new Milano spaceship, the poly bag that he showed you there. That was in the little little bin, cool poly bags there. Uh, right. Uh, yeah, back. yeah, right there. Yeah. That's the new Milano, isn't it? Right? The new Milano? Yeah. Yep. Uh, the exclusive Series 7 chicken has been released, or Series 9, whatever. It's at Target. Uh, customized go-karts don't care for. Ooh, this is pretty exciting the other day. Yeah, that was pretty cool. I did see that, too, all over the place. What's up with them coming out with these good Harry Potter sets and pricing them reasonably? 20 bucks. I mean, it's 132 pieces, so that's actually a little low, but 20 they're bucks. Trying kill, they're trying to kill the the market for the, the older no. stuff. Yeah, but these are these are two brand new figs. This is a fantastic beast. That's actually not a bad little cart build, you know. You swap that horse Look out. Horse. Look at that, man. Yeah, wings, crazy wings on that horse. That's 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 good twenty dollar value right there. Yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, the a movie named Newt Scamanders. I gotta, I gotta watch this movie again. I haven't only seen it once. Where you can feature a brick built suitcase, which, uh, see, I don't know about that. So that's like that pop up book thing. Yeah, hmm. yeah. Pop up book. Mr. H, what's up, brother? How you doing? What we got? What we got? Hmm, I can't. I, I don't want to watch that video. Huh? So I want to get our. Oh, we work for free now. I can watch this thing on. All right, what the hell? Come on, what's this? What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Come on, I don't see anything. I don't see no carrot. Oh, there it goes. Oh, okay, so that there it is. That's what it is right there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's a new movie. Oh, I didn't know it was a new movie. Oh, yep. Oh, it's a new movie coming out. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. See how see how far behind I am, folks. I live under a rock. All right. A rock. New Year's Incredibles oh. two. Oh, that's not a bad looking set. There you go. Got the drill. Got a drill. Interesting. 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 What else you got? Uh, let me see here. Uh, do, 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 do. Under my rank. Okay. Okay. Oh, sand green. Okay. Good to get some sand green. Yep. Uh, what's this? Incredibles and other junior sets. Incredibles. <sighs> Oh, little baby incredible. Oh, that's kind of cool. This guy's just skateboarding all over the place. Okay. This this was disappointing to me. Why? Disappointing for what? I love it. It's awesome. I, I like it too. I do. But uh what are you I was expecting a, a classic with the actual Jeep, like the Jurassic Park Jeep. Oh, uh, okay. So okay. That, that, I when, when I say it's disappointing, that's what I mean. It's disappointing. So I was expecting the I'm so happy for the set. It's a cool scene, but I was hoping we get the Jeep. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. There was but, two uh, sets, right? Is there was there another? I think there's the other one right here. Yeah. I got that blue Jeep for you. No, I meant like the uh, the the green one, the, like the classic original. green one. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know. Oh, you got that blue one too. That's why, you got, that's why you got to come to Philly on Saturday so you can give him my, my Jeep. You got a Mohawk. Okay, got the Mohawk. This is forty mohawk. bucks. That's gonna be forty. 360 pieces. Get it for the figs, man. Get it for the figs. Yeah. Yeah, no, I think it's worth it. I mean, it's a good set. I think it's a good set. I'm going to send a text out. 
send a text out. I'm gonna have to retake. I'm gonna. I'm gonna have to retake this picture now. Ain't gonna be nobody in the middle. I gotta update update our thumbnail and everything now when we're done here. Oh, you can build What's this. That? Lego Space oh, Ideas really? winning model controversy. Oh, well, oh, ooh, controversy. Where's Iceberg at? We need to get the freeze burn. Uh, the freeze, uh, whatever the hell is called it. Freeze zone. Dun, dun, dun. What's it say? It says the Lego Ideas moment in space winner was announced a few weeks ago, but when you look at it at first, it would you would think uh, you wouldn't think there would be some controversy behind it. As you can see above the winning entry, it was a coin-operated space shuttle by that guy that you can probably find in front of a supermarket or a convenience store. This is where the controversy comes in. It may or not have been a big coincidence. People are looking too much into it. Samuel over at the Brickset Forums had been probably members with the forum. The instructions for the 2016 Lego Brand Manager Retail Conference, which is also a coin operation shuttle shown below. As you can see, they do have some similarities, and the creator has stated that they've never seen the retail conference build before. Sure. Yeah, I think uh, Coldwater yeah. said a big, big to do about nothing. He said a big yeah. to do about nothing. That looks exactly like that. Not even close, but... Not even close. Not even close, because completely different ship, in my opinion. Bigger front, tails. People are just sour that they lost. Sour, sour dough, and that's what. Now we're back to that. Back to that. March 11th. So we're all caught up, folks. All caught, caught up. up. Guess what time it is? Guess what time it is? G poo. Guess what time it is? All right, I'm about to get that number three. Uh, you know the you know the drill. We got Somniac. We got Br. We got Minifig Collector. All with two. So here we go. Hey, cl classic plastic. Let let them know how many people are going to be at Philly. That's hauling and balling crew. All three of them. We got a uh, we got a uh, special uh, special surprise for everybody hauling and balling crew. So, all right, you guys know what series I run from. So just throw it out there. Keep going. Throw it out there. We got to We'll get a winner tonight. We only got two weeks left. So there's only two weeks left of this. And hopefully we'll well we will have a winner by then, but there's only two chances to get in the in the running here. So somebody needs to either dethrone BR and Somniac or Minifig Collector is going to uh try to get back in it. But I haven't seen him chatting, so I don't know. He might not be here. So he may he may be stuck at a one uh one entry, which is not gonna do it. Do 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 I went a little did it start yet? What? Yeah, oh. we started. What the heck, man! I give until fifty-one. We got till fifty-one. CMF, right? It's a CMF. CMF. Uh. CMF. Oh, I almost did Rocket Boy. I almost did Rocket Boy tonight. I almost did Team Mom too. Hoosier. Almost did that too. <sighs> All right. Jack Diesel. Jack Shaquille O'Neal. Dwarf Warrior. That's a good my one. Entry in. <sighs> There's my entry. Boom. Oh. Oh man, pirate from Sir. No, Damn. none of that. Oh, okay. Man, mm. Corn Kai, no, Black Canary, mm. Roller mm. Penguin Boy. Well, that's a good one too. Mr. Burns, Penguin, mm. Face Man, my motorcycle mechanic, graduate, genie in a bottle. No. Saxophone guy. That's a good one. That's B for C's torso. You see the one above it though? Someone said Smithers. No. No, you just said Smithers. <laughs> <laughs> the imp. I like food bricks with the imp. That's good. Hmm. The rocket ship boy, Shark General, Buffalo Bills figs. No. <laughs> Chief Wiggum, Shark Guy, Gingerbread Man, Wildlife Photographer, Plant Monster, no Mickey Mouse, no. Frank Rock. Oh, that's a good one too. Nope. That is hmm. not it. Scarecrow. Concession vendor, animal catcher. Nope. Skeleton boy, killer moths, another good one. Shark guy, astronaut, Daisy Duck, clumsy guy. I almost put clumsy guy in there too, MacGyver. That's a good one too. I almost put clumsy guy in there. Peter Pan, I'm assuming Angry Dragon will go with that. No, Minnie Mouse, female boxer, brick foot, pig farmer, alien troop, grandma visitor, farmer, mm. Peter Pan, no, Egyptian warrior. No. Hey, a stump is just as good as a win for me. Yeah, I guess stump, stump, stump city tonight. It looks like you guys got about. I'll give you the two minutes because we were a little bit late to it. I'll go to fifty-two. Janitor, Santa Claus, Egyptian warrior, Detective Gordon. Nope. Jewel thief, battle mech, 
No. Tweet. No. Tiki. No. Cyborg Girl. Bumblebee Woman. No. Haven't seen it yet. Rock Climber. Another good one. I had him in the in my hand tonight too. I was going to put him in there. Zombie Cheerleader. Benny. Harley Quinn. Waiter. Bagpiper. Where's my pants guy? Butcher. Fisherman. Welder. Baseball player. Oh, BR's just rolling through them now. Disco mm. Batman. Stacker. Joker. Unicorn Girl, Tom Brady Fig, Animal Control Officer, Veterinarian, Hefner Batman, Black Lightning, Yuppie, Ric Flair, Old West Lady Robot, British Policeman, Bella Dancer, Gangsta. Man, I can do this all night. And you will. And, and now my lag, now my lag got me. Mission Impossible Thief, Aladdin, Hazmat. Ooh, Hazmat's right next to me. A muchacho, henchman. Here's Hazmat right here. He's chilling. He's chillaxing right next to me here. Jewel Thief, Wrestler, Harley Quinn. I gotta get it. Oh, I still got BR up on the on the dial here. That's why I'm that's why I'm lagging. Classic police, classic policeman. I like your style. Who's your one per case? Lobster Batman, Lady Liberty, Painter, Butterfly Girl. I have not seen it yet, so I, I don't I know for sure I haven't seen it yet. But Minotaur, Taco Tuesday guy, Grandpa, Deb Ramey. What's going on, Deb? How you doing? Just a little guest poo action going on here. Bigfoot. Shark guy, painter, 80s workout lady. I like that one, Mr. H. That's a good one. Yeti, mariachi guy. Good one, cool kid coming out. Yeti, left shark. You guys were rolling. I thought it was going to get nipped because you guys were in the right area before, but skydiver, battle goddess, island warrior, cat lady. I throw these little hits out there so everybody hits on, but cell phone guy, painter, bumblebee girl, but bunny suit guy. All right, we're gonna have to. Uh, I think we're gonna have to end it up now. So, Br, can you want to throw the end out there? And whoever's uh, throw that end out there, and I'm gonna see if there it is. And everybody's no winner. So we got no winner. No winner. Everybody want to see who it is? Yeah, yeah. Everybody wants to see who it is. All right, there. That's who it is tonight. You guys were in the, in the, you guys were in range too. Ah, Larry the barista. Larry the barista. You guys were, you guys had Taco Tuesday. You guys were doing a, a little. Uh, you guys were close. You guys were definitely close on that one. So, I saw some Lego Movie guesses out there. I thought you were going to hit it once the. Uh, yeah, Bones Bricks. That was it. You're, you're the winner. You get a point. Yeah. A little late there, buddy. <laughs> Just like we were to the party tonight. Late. <laughs> All right, so going into next week, it's literally <sighs> unless minifig collector can. Where, where's minifig collector at tonight, man? I don't know. I didn't see him. <sighs> man, did he? Where did he say it? Did he say it after the end? I didn't even see it. Did he? Overpriced coffee, he said. Oh, uh, he did. Yeah, overpriced coffee. Would that would that would that have counted as a win though? I I, I would give it to him. Overpriced I probably coffee. I'd give it to him. Yeah, I probably would have given it to yeah, him. I would have give it to him. Yeah, we would have gave it to you, Ob. But, but Larry Larry the barista is the proper name, so I don't know. You were below the. You were below the. Well, yeah, we would. You know. I don't, I don't know if he if he said Larry or if he said the barista. I would have counted overpriced coffee would have been a judge's decision. It's up to BOT. Yeah. 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 Uh, Survey says. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, that's that's just a phrase. You know, I was it's still good. Yeah. We know what you meant. Yeah. And it, and it was that typed after BR said end. So it, yeah. it's it's mood at this point anyway. So. Yeah. 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 yeah, guy, yeah. Anyway. This guy here is also. He's there. There he is. Look, he's a special guest. Iceberg. Oh, is he there? No, he's, he's in your hand. Yeah. There he is. I, I don't do a good iceberg impression, so. I, I don't even know. I never tried. I got to put myself on mute first to try. Hang on. <laughs> B- I do a great one. Where are the white women at? <laughs> B- B- there we go. We could, we could have had BOT play iceberg for this, yeah. for this, for this one. Oh, man. I, I don't know if it's good. I don't want to try. I'll try it off camera, see if it's good. Oh, man. No, I no chip classic. It's like six minutes to eight. I, I'm thinking there's not going to be any iceberg tonight, but we'll. Uh, Hope we don't hit an iceberg. We'll have to. Um, 
what do we got? I checked it tonight. We got how many more? What's the count for the weeks? We got one, two, three. We got four more weeks of shows before Philly. So that means four four more guests. And actually, it's going to be three more guests because we're going to try to get Iceberg back on next week. Hopefully, we can get him back on um, next week. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Um, we're going to we'll have him in the, in the HQ next week. So, tell, so far, we've only had two guests that have qualified for the H&B swag bag. And that is our friend Hoosier Bricks and Bubba Bricks as well. Bubba so, Bricks. You guys will both be getting your H&B swag bag. Speaking of Bubba, what, what's going on with the glow zone? I don't know. You should ask him. I think he's in the chat. What do you mean, what's going on with it? Like, it is, uh, oh. How many entries are going in there this year? Is there a lot of people building for the glow zone? I, I, I really wouldn't know because I really haven't heard well, it. Well, partially because nobody from – Philly Brickfest ever responds to your emails, right? Well, that's what, yeah. I mean, I know there hasn't been any, like, oh, CKD's snap. He's been waiting for an answer for weeks, just about a four day ticket. Who is? CKB. Nobody's oh. ever emailed him back. Dang. Yeah, I don't, uh, I know last year they had a lot of uh, hype leading up to the, the day, and I have not seen any of that hype. Yeah. So I don't I don't know about that, but no, I come on, Darth Hall. Iceberg knew it was seven. Come on, he texted me. He was he was just having internet issues. So um, unfortunately, we've we've all been there and done that. So I know Jenny was getting a couple, but that, that's I don't know if they have a different vendor email person, but she was getting emails from them. Uh, and she had a couple questions about setup and everything, and they, they were responding back to her. But I don't know if that's somebody different doing the the vendor stuff versus the ticket. I, I have no honestly, I have no clue. I really don't know. So, yeah, see what the weather's gonna be like this week. Supposed to get some more snow. You are? I think so. I we were supposed to get something, but then they now it's all supposed to be like sunny and like thirty degrees. So. Let's see. It says Wednesdays. Yeah, hey, they don't care about people, man. They don't care about making money. Wednesday snow wind. Let's see. Come on now, minifig collector. You missed your you missed your chance to tie up the guest poo. You're gonna have to tune in next week because there's only one more week. That's it. You got one more chance to so, tie up. Is there? Then... So what's the score right now with one week to go? It's Zomniak and VR at two, and minifig collector at one. So technically, so what happens if there's a two way tie? It, we, th we throw them in the randomizer and uh, it's 50 50 percent chance of snow one one to three inches yep. so whoever hits the randomizer top spot because there's only two of them so we will randomize it like 10 times mm. Mm -hmm. uh he was on the bus from the lug meeting where mary got a fishing store for all the events she attended today congratulations oh yeah I, oh, I, I, did... thought, I thought mary was the bus for mc i don't know Drive them around. I don't know. Oh, okay. People drive around Las Vegas, or they just they just walk around. Okay, so he was. On, I did see Mary post that the, in the beginning of the chat. I forgot. I forgot to see that she did get the fishing store. So that is fantastic. Yeah, yeah that's Story. awesome. Yeah. Oh man, what a week! And this one went by fast today. Why? Oh, because we were talking about the death of Toys R Us. That did. That definitely went by quick. I'm gonna laugh when they just say, ah, "Actually, we're gonna start over again." Toys aren't us. We could, uh, I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see about that flash pants. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe if there's a tie, we can, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll hook something up because Somniac's going to be with us too. He'll be traveling with us. He's hauling and balling family. So, yeah, yeah. If there's a tie, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll get something it out. Yeah. We'll post it in Philly though when we're all together, like that album cover we did back last year. Oh, yeah. Drop it. You know, I still have that set. I got to build it. It's in the storage. <laughs> I got to do a lot. I got to get a lot out. My, my, I gave mine away. What did you get? You had some. Uh, <laughs> it's on the Philly page. Uh, I, I remember the first thing I won, I said, just put it in the auction because it was like some friend's 100 piece set. I was like, I don't want that. Yeah, it was. Uh, <laughs> put it in the I auction. Was, what did I get? Like the Christmas magnet and like the turkey set or something? The creepy some, uh, pilgrim guy? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, thanks, Just for Bricks. We appreciate you. Hey, I did find you. I was down here. Like I said, I haven't been down here too often, but I did find your uh, your Hulk there. So he's going out. To, he'll going out tomorrow to you. So look out for that. Just for Bricks, gonna be coming oh. to you, Hulk man. Hulk mania. 
just for being cool. It's a kind of a big box, but it's okay. It'll get to you. Jesus. That's, what said. That's a $15 dollar shipping rack. <laughs> no, it'll, it'll be good. I'll, I'll do it like I'll do it like media mail and it'll it'll take a month to get there. Oh man. So but yeah, look at man, we rolled up that right up oh. until till eight o'clock. Um I'm gonna throw it out there, guys. I don't know if they're on next, but we're gonna give it to. We're gonna shout anyway. Pink bucket happy hour, nine p.m. Maybe for uh, Smith's channel, and then I don't know. Br bot, you know if uh, what's his face? <laughs> Big B's doing the. Uh, oh, what's his face? Oh, uh, nine p.m. tonight. There we go. Oh, there you go. Food big dropping it. Thank you. Seller streams at nine p.m. tonight. We'll be having a Bricklink rep with them. Oh, another one. Yeah, oh. the rep wasn't there last week. So oh. what's there? Got it. Cool, cool. So that's on Big B's channel. So it looks like so. Got... So there's going to be a million questions about brick arms. Is that what it's going to be? It could be. It could be. Got to tune in to see that. Bot. Will they be allowing the sale of Lepin? <laughs> that that would be the first and only question I would have. Does it so. does it smell like Lepin in here? Doesn't Lepin own them now? Uh, man. Yeah, Lepin is the Soho Brick Corporation, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Connor. I appreciate that, man. Yeah, I uh, I definitely let. Yeah, you're 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 my go-to when it comes to minifigs identification so oh i did pick yeah you might know that. i did pick up a davy jones in a, in a bulk lot this week yeah it smells like lepin i can smell it from here hey speaking of that if, check you guys come see us at philly we, we might have something for some people so but we'll we'll keep uh we'll keep put, putting that out too so we're gonna have some Open surprises in philly this year <laughs> we're definitely gonna have some cool surprises so you want to be hanging out with the holland and balling crew at philly this year especially bot because he's gonna be there yeah yeah all right, we're gonna show, show that one. We're yeah, gonna show, yeah, we're, yeah. Gonna show, we're gonna show that just because it's that's that's how it should be right there. Boom. Yeah. Boom shagalaga. All right. So we're gonna cut this up because I got <laughs> I got dog duty upstairs to get to. So Ew. Fantastic. No, not duty like. Yeah, you said you got dog duty upstairs. Duty like I, it's my job. Hey, so. go pick it up. Go pick it up. Hey, we got two minutes of overtime. That's what we do for you guys. Five, five fifty six, five fifty four. We just picked up one tonight. So um, I, I forget who it was, but we just picked up another one tonight. So um, again, six hundred. We'll give away, we'll give something away because that's what we do. Um, but you can catch Colin and Bomb. We appreciate all your guys' help, uh, continued support. I got to say that again because we always say that. One hundred thirty eight episodes strong. The Guinness Book of World Records for the most continuously streamed weekly show involving lego check it out it's an actual world record i already checked it out so um yeah thanks a lot the moat there yeah too much information for sure but um guys we are on instagram we're on facebook we are on youtube thanks for all crushing that like button tonight we really do appreciate it um where else can you find us you can find us on Flickr, tumblr t harmony grinder e harmony is a new one that is fantastic aol.com copyserve.com farmers only.com alt.com match.com um christian mingle.com Everywhere you guys want us to be, that's where we continue to be. So for myself, Fick and Bricks, Dr. Lucky, uh, Brick Blaze, feel better. Brick Somniac, feel better, man. We saw, I saw you guys both. Yeah, right yeah, now. yeah. Feel better. Feel better, guys. We'll see you, uh, Somniac, in, in about a month. So, again, for myself, Fick and Bricks, Dr. Lucky, B-O-T-B-R, say your goodbyes. Bye, everybody. Thank you for watching us, and we will see you next week. Where's the pepper board, you fat sums of bitch? Keep hauling and balling, guys.